okay, this is it. This is my whole inventory. Three diapers, two breads, and a feather. <laughs> we're, we're, we're going. We're, we're managers. Okay. So Life Forcer says, congratulations on finding a brand new, brand new Kusoge that nobody had ever seen before Pomato CX. I really feel that way. I feel... <laughs> yeah. This is amazing. Wait a minute, wait, the Kusoge, like, ultimate crap game? Isn't that what the Kusoge, Kusoge is? just means a crappy game. Crap game? So really, Spartanberry, if there's not too much text to this, let's do this. It is an interesting game, for sure. So the item stores in this game are 7-Elevens? Something like that, they're kind of like Namco stores. But you can also go to department stores to buy things. So Kevin Chai says, I don't want to steal from another website. Someone on, says someone on a show called Pomeo CX. Aww. <laughs> I stole from a show, not a website. Yeah. Besides, Arino is never gonna find oh, it out. Oh yeah, well, Spartan Race says, well, this game does have crap in it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I'm down here. I think we're kind of going back to the same place. Good, yeah. Uh, yeah. I just want to like see if there's any buildings I can go to. I think um, to the north there was stuff. Okay. I think I need second dinner at this point. You want second dinner? I think so. What did we have? Thai food. Oh yeah, that was good. I wanted more though. Are they still open? No. <laughs> Everyone get Thai food, it is great. Let's see. I really like the fact that they were speaking what seemed like actual correct language. They were, probably, they were probably making fun of us. Yeah. Who are these foreigners? The only ones that are at a restaurant. <laughs> Can you, what, oh, okay, never mind. Uh, it was blocked off. So, rating. Your willingness to make one fan art, two equals fanfic, three equals fan translation. Ooh! I don't know, I, I never want to write fan fiction though. Yeah, I want, I want to have some kind of interesting rating system though. Okay, and so that's I, the town we were at, and yeah, then this... That's, that's the, yeah. That's, that's the building I don't want to go to yet. I'm too scared to leave town. Everything will kill us. Poop killed us. Oh, oh, keep going to your right. Okay. Ah, a port. What is that? The Statue of Liberty needs to... It's... Oh! Jason! His name is Splatter. From Splatterhouse? I think so. That's wonderful. Is Splatterhouse a Namco game? I don't know. Seems like uh, there might have right. been more to his name, too, but I didn't see it in time. Oh, he's dead. Yeah. Four is host a camp fan gamer for it. Five equals new religions. Here, Mano. What does this say? Airfare. Airline. Okay, so yeah, this is a uh, air airport. Yeah. Where do you want to go? We're not ready to go to Hawaii oh. yet. Oh, crap. Can't go there. Can't go there. That one isn't going. That one's, like, canceled. Hawaii. Crap. Hawaii. Let's go to Hawaii. Uh, but they're all, like, filled. Go to Hawaii anyway. Let's throw some people off the plane. So why why are you offering them anything? Because I can't go to you. So you can go Pro north. Probably like eventually the airplane, the airport will open up yeah. and you can go. So places. Andrew Ray says, "Yep, Namco did Splatterhouse." There yep. he is. His name is Splatter. See what he see what he does. I kill him. He dies. He hits you with a machete. Can I go through these trees? What's here? Nothing. Alright, I'm gonna defend and see what he does. Well, he hit me. What do you do? He just had some stuff at you. Blah! Be my fan, Splatter! Oh, there's NK's new art right there. Here's a red building going to Okay, me. yeah. But I can't get to the spirit building yet. What does he say? Some, some company destroyed a bridge, so you need to take a plane to get to a certain like area of town, another town. Oh, so, okay. Why can't I take the train? I want to go over there. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, so this is a part of town I can't get to yet, so the place I have to go to now... Whoa. Look at this sad just man. A, just a normal guy is his name. He attacked me. 
Tomato no chosen Joe. <laughs> That's a good one. Tomato, um, I don't think I'm gonna make it through that other building. Um, do you think I should challenge the building though? The, the Niamco? Yeah. Yeah, just try it and see how okay. they work. Maybe just run from everything if you can. We seem really over leveled at this point. No, I need to get to level 8 because that means I'll be popular. Really? Yeah. Is that what they said? Yeah, at the beginning of the I game. Okay. I'm getting tired and also I want to eat so chicken I dinner. So I think when you... No, I think that we needed 8 um, popularity points to get to the next level. We didn't need to get to level 8. Oh. So I'm already super popular. I then. think so. Okay, here's the place I need to go to. There's barf all over the streets of Tokyo. I bet you there's not. Yeah, so Life Force just says this game really is way too much like Takeshi no Chosen Joe. Programmer. No, I don't think so. Like, this game makes sense. Um, Takeshi's challenge didn't. Yeah, I mean, it, this makes more sense than it does. But yeah. it still makes. <laughs> it's still very confusing. So chat, what do you guys think? Should I break this, when I put this on YouTube, should I put this video all as one big video for like two hours, or should I break it into pieces? Because this is going to be the first one in the whole series of Famicom exploration games. If you want to make it, yeah, I guess... Because usually I break them up into pieces, but since there's going to be so many... I guess just a giant one then. Maybe I get the feeling it's this one. Let me force it says what I thought a lot of people would say. This game makes sense. Or this game makes sense. You're an idol that goes around wearing diapers and fighting random men. No, oh, yeah. But it totally makes sense, though. Once you figure it out what to do. Yeah. Like, the specifics do not make sense. Yeah. But the game does. <laughs> like, why you're doing that. Yeah. Uh-oh. I better eat some bread. Oh. Oh, nothing. Okay. I should get... Oh, darn it, I thought I had it. I hate Namco. Oh, man, and this is the reason I can't carry around bread, because all my idols can't are just peeing their pants. Once we get a certain spell... Alright. I've, ne I've never actually encountered that word ever. Um... The, what nature's call? Is that how I guess you could localize when it? When nature calls? Yeah. <laughs> um, I've never seen that in Japanese, like in real normal Japanese. This is like the first time I've encountered it. So I'm glad, I'm glad that my vocab had that handy. We're getting a little bit distressed here. How can I take him to like, um, a restaurant in the middle of a dungeon? Um, I don't know. I just have to go home. So Jamprov, this is called Famicom Exorcism for now because we are we have a box of like 200, 300 Famicom games and we are going to randomly pick them every so often and play it. We are exorcising them from this realm. We are releasing them from because they've been uh, their spirits have been wandering in our house for too long. Yes, because we have ignored them for so long and they're like yokai. And although yeah. although we've been asking the chat for a better name for this series. Yes. So, Mr. Tinda and many others have been pr providing ideas. Famicom Ghostbusters. That was kind of what I was thinking the whole time. Oh, but then they'll think we're playing Famicom Ghostbusters. I know, seriously. Exactly, yeah. Fami cleansing. <laughs> Puricom. Oh, crap. Do we have a Famicom disk system? Yep. Actually, we do, but we never talked it up yet. We only know if it works. Let oh, me... shoot, shoot. Oh, I'm not going to make it through here. But I want to keep fighting because I yeah. want to get points and money. Yeah, that's fine. And we can take a... Yes! Yes! Perfect! I was about to use bread! Yes! Family Kai Watch. I get so excited playing this game. It's like a really you, bad you, game. You really fist pumped there. I like this game. <laughs> <laughs> I am a fan. I'm glad. I think there's... Like a, a chart that you can probably do when you play these games. When we we, we dis we're excited, then we discover what the game is, and suddenly our interest just plummets like, to negative. We're ready to quit, and then we figure it out. And we're like, okay. We give it a little time, and then it kind of builds up. Maybe I could have an ongoing meter. Yeah, yeah. On on the stream. So like, I do want to have like a point system. Like, yeah. I, 
Play it to completion, I think. Unless we do it ourselves, we can't say that. Oh. I think so. Okay. Hmm. Would you buy it if you saw it in a used game store? And then, like, like that thing you said, if a friend tried to give it to you, would you even accept it? If a friend gave it to me for free, mm -hmm. I would probably take it. Mm -hmm. um, if, I no. saw it, if I saw it. Yeah, yeah, if you saw it, like, on the side of the road, would you pick it up? Like, if it was a gift, would you accept it? Yeah, I think uh, this one I would. But I think the chat really needs to play a part in this. If you guys saw this for sale, would you buy it? Knowing now what it is. Yeah, would you guys would you guys go get this? Assuming it's a reasonable price, whatever the reasonable price is, would you guys get it? And also, if you saw it on the side of the road, would you take it or would you throw it further into the road? <laughs> I, I like that. Okay. <laughs> would you buy it? Would you accept it as a gift? And would you rescue it from the road or push it under a car? <laughs> I like that. I like it. Okay. You want to go with that point system? I'll have to write it down. Okay. To, to what? So a bunch of people, King Daring would buy it. Well, let's let's set, a, buy it. let's set a price for the games though, because. Um, let's say this was four dollars. Really? I was gonna say like five to ten. Yeah. Okay. Say this oh, I made it to a door. Oh. What's this guy? It says, "Oh my, um, I have suddenly suddenly have urgent business, so." Um, now I can't go to the town that we're supposed to go to, Gowasu. Yeah, because the planes are down. So I wanted to rest my weary bones in the hot springs. But, um, oh, that's too bad. By the way, I'm a little bit hungry. Do you have anything? Like, can you go buy something for me? I have bread. Can you go get me some... Uh, I don't know how to translate that. I never know how to translate that one. But we need to go get him a thing. No, oh, sorry. I've got, I've got bread. You're eating bread. Go get it. And I'll give you an air, air ticket. Ah, oh, okay. Do you want to use our wing 